Hello there everyone and thank you for joining me here at the start of a new campaign in Hearts of Iron 4 Vanilla with a By Blood Alone DLC which we're playing as everyone's favorite Swiss nation, Switzerland. We're talking about Swiss guiding principles right here at the very, very start, but the game doesn't lag too hard. The Swiss Confederation stands as the oldest democracy in the continent, but the precipitous pace of change in Europe is putting this at risk. Should we continue this course laid by the Eidgenossenschaft and the Constitution of 1848, will a new path reveal itself to us? Get some political power, balance power in Switzerland with the federal council and canton sides. Or begins. Starts with 100% towards the cantons. Uh, that's not bad. National Defense Fund, ooh, but consumer goods are good. And three civvies, National Defense Fund, yes please. The defense of a country requires more than sweat and toil, and we also need funds for improving or importing equipment and the raw materials needed to prepare for the worst. Establishing and promoting a fund where Swiss citizens can contribute voluntarily will allow us to offset any military budget increase. And put on display the Swiss participatory attitudes, which will be a great, great grand thing, Swiss guiding principles. The political situation inside and around the Swiss Confederation is deteriorating quickly. There's a growing movement advocating for guiding principles to steer the ship in the right direction during the pending storm, but the question is which one? Also, I do apologize if the game volume is just a bit loud for me. There we go. That's slightly better. Uh, we do not know what our neighbors will do, but we must decide now what, to, what course of action will allow Switzerland to survive. Protect our democratic and neutral values. We should be more active about promoting our democracy. Neutrality is untenable under these circumstances. So, um, overall, uh, we have this. The Federal Council of Switzerland has stood since 1848 as a stalwart zenith of Swiss democracy. Three, we have three assigned political advisors taking the, the roles of leading councillors, and every year one of them can be selected as a president of the Confederation, unlocking a special decision. There should never be an empty political advisor position, otherwise penalties will apply to the country. And president is currently Rudolf Minger, and we are leading councillors as well. Um, so we have these guys here. They're very democratic, and so yeah. However, with this path, as you can tell from the thumbnail and title, um, we want, I want to go down this way. Press for Vorlberg. I want to go with the Allied Gold Gotthard Boon because we want to be a very aggressive democracy. Because we can Anschluss, hopefully, readily, pretty quickly. So, lots of support for the FB, Federal Assembly. Some 50% for the FB. So, it can't be very fascist. And we can't have very much for the Federal Assembly. So, right now, we are starting with the balance of power here, over here. Also, I do want to let you know, um, I did pay for the DLC myself. I did not get it from Paradox. So... Just like you guys, I did spend $20. If you have the Buy Blood Alone DLC, I spent my money as well to get it. So we are have to go at least to this center one, because right now we're here. And it's killing our war support. But it's very cheap for political advisors, which is whatever. But we got to get over there. So we got to push that more dire that direction. But to get over here to do the Presvorlberg and Gotthard Bund, the balance power is a lot of the strong cantonal power range. But we gotta do that quickly enough because the balance power has to be the right of strong council range. So, um, so basically, we're gonna go to neutrality is untenable during under these circumstances. Increase defense budget. Well, we did manage to maintain our neutrality and sovereignty in the Great War. Uh, we can't rest on our laurels. There is a real possibility one of the great powers that surround us will invade our country to circumvent the fortifications built between them. And our current budget will not be enough to prevent this. Also, if we have to use constant commands in uh, this campaign, we will just because this is on a historical, and you never know what's going to happen on a historical. Also, we have these militia divisions. Six combat with their mountaineers, which is pretty nice. And we have officers as well, of course, like normal, but still. Uh, early mobilization. Ooh, I want more daily army XP, but... Well, I guess we have no chief of the navy. That makes sense. We have no command power right now. So, yeah, early mobilization it is. Actually, that's all. We can't even go here, so we, don't, we definitely don't have that war support. Elections for the president of the Swiss Confederation. Every year, the Swiss Federal Assembly chooses one of the councillors to be president of the Swiss Confederation. At first, amongst equals, he will use his limited powers to represent the council and break any ties in the council to gently steer the council towards safety or glory. Once the council becomes the president of the Confederation, they will not be able to assign a political advisor again, but they have a powerful decision at their disposal. When a political advisor is slot is vacant for too long, you will suffer penalties to make sure they fill the position quickly. Who should the assembly elect to be the face of the Swiss Confederation this year? Like Abba Maya. Move towards the side of the Federal Council, remove after 90 days. Weekly stability gain, but you lose weekly war support. More daily democracy. Johannes Bauman. Um, more weekly. Exact same things. Bauman will be removed. Giuseppe Motta. They're all exact same, so it doesn't even matter. So, uh, once a new president is selected in a year, he will not be able to available as a political advisor confederation president again. Giuseppe. Giuseppe. So now we can choose whoever we want, which is actually fine with me. We can get a fascist in power. Ooh. We can't have too much fascism, though. Kelbelt. Militaristic Democrat. A diplomat. So, civic construction speed. What else do we have here? Conservative Democrat. A diplomat. Intelligence officer's not bad. We can wait for that one, though. 
Daily Political Power, Daily Fashion Spark, Philip Etter, went higher towards move towards way more towards the Federal Council. Oh, and this is a 70 day focus, good Jesus Christ. 50% more political power, holy shnikes! Humanitarian? Well, we don't, we don't have humanitarian for all the time. Very interesting to see what type of people we can get here. Fascist broadcaster. This is actually very unique, and I like what the devs have done. The Paradox, de paradox devs, so. Um, this is unaligned. We are going unaligned, basically. This route is unaligned version, so. Um, but yeah, 50% social democrat? No. No, conservative democrat? No. Humanitarian? 50%. Screw that. 2.36 every single day. Jesus Christ, that's amazing. Demobilize our economy? Well, why would we? So this is democratic tradition. Um, Turkish Straits remain demilitarized. So Germany is still going to be aggressive. Nazi Party representative Switzerland assassinated. David Frankfurt, a Jewish corrupt living in Bern, turned himself into the Graubund and police and confessed to the assassination of Wilhelm Gustav, leader of the Nazi Party's foreign organization in Switzerland. He cited the Nazi Party's harmful beliefs towards Jewish people and the Gustav's role in spreading them in Switzerland as a reason for the shooting. How we choose to respond or proceed as potentially the issue will be used by the German Reich and the rest of the world as a way to measure our dedication to neutrality and rule of law. Fair trial? Get the maximum sentence right away. Let's see what happens. So right now we're 94%. It's slowly going this direction, which is fine. Get more command power. Army speed would be very nice. Uh, more command power, more command power. Um, cost is increased by plus 10. Oh, Jesus. We don't want to accelerate too fast, but still. Because we do need to get at least over here faster. So, And then just kind of blitz through all, all the stuff. So, But the one thing about... Um, that nice. Keep building yourselves up. The, the Hoi 4 now, it's just, it's, it moves pretty darn quick, I, and it's, it has for a while, but which I like, so. Partial mobilization? Oh, right. Army XP, anything here, Commander Chief? Promote Henri, oh, yeah. Wow, plus 0.4 Army XP gain. Jesus Christ. That's so good. They both have that. You get Division Defense and more daily command power gain, but less experience gain. It's kind of okay, I prefer this guy probably. Um, reaffirm spiritual defense. Our confederation has been committed to the defense of Swiss national values since 1932 in response to the growing threat of the authoritarianism around it. Now more than ever, the menace looms large, so we must renew our pledge to defend our way of life physically and spiritually. Get more political power, lose 50% more recruitable population factor, lose war support, get more less fa military factory construction speed, and more civvy factory speed, which is alright. Probably don't need to focus on the navy. Um, air superiority, infantry would be nice, but we don't have the 30 command power. The artillery is not bad either. Fortress Switzerland? Oh, I'm sure there's an achievement for that. Ground support? That's not bad. Plus 0.3. Jesus Christ. I want to get the arm XP for so. Keep building, 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 building. We lose. What is this? Demobilizer. That strikes. Well, yeah, you might as well do that. Come on, get us that goddamn command power. We'll get like nothing. Why would we choose mobile warfare? Of all things for us to choose, why would we choose mobile warfare? You know what? Give us the arm XP. Fortified border with Italy. Fortified border with Germany. Two line force in every province. Well, let's do this one first. Replace war bonds with ongoing rearmament. You bet we will be rearming ourselves. So, all right. I don't want this one. It's expensive to do. Two, one. God dang it. Well, at least we got more than that. We can reuse. But we get at least one for now. That'll help us out a little bit. 2.36 is so nice, though. It's so nice to have. Still 1936, so get some radio. And unfortunately, we can use these divisions, but they're not very good. Uh, these guys are 6 combo width, and these guys are also 6 combo width, and these guys are also 6 combo width, so. Don't really want to train any more divisions. We well, guess we can if we really wanted to, but. It is what it is. We're from Spiritual Defense. Reforce the border of France. I'd like to reforce our border, but I'm going to blitz through this and hopefully get down to Entrelosing as fast as possible, so. That's an 80% support for the. These guys. So they're going down every day. Um, so we'll, get, we'll keep working on that. Put a board with Italy. Fortify a board with Germany, maybe. Yeah. 
German Reich posed an existential threat to the survival of the Swiss Confederation. A war broke out between Germany and the and French. The Germans went past through Switzerland instead of having it fortified by a border with France or through the Netherlands and Belgium. We can build fortifications between our countries to deter the German Reich. As we should. Nice. Because we should do that one so we can do this one too. And so to the balance of power is to the right of strong council control. Strong council control is right here. So so to the right. And so we're slowly just really knocking that down, which is great. More command power. We have so much political power. Oh, we need more worship for that one too. Yeah, that sucks. That'd be so good to get though. Spain's killing itself. Yay. Um We don't get more daily army XP here though, which is Only Swiss citizens militia cannot train regular forces outside of citizen militias and cannot edit existing templates outside of military readiness decisions. Oh, Jesus Christ. But I guess we get air. We really want it. Of all things, we'll start working on our air doctrine. I thought this is Swiss plateau. I thought these are pikemen. Mm. Well. Sure, why not? Moose oh, is 25%, that's a lot. What if I the border with the Germans? Yes, please. Ban foreign uh, Nazi propaganda. We can have this vehicle for propaganda product to stand. Nazism goes against every single value that defines the Swiss Federation. For this reason, it cannot be tolerated in a country built on democracy and tolerance like ours. Lest we risk them being inside. Or thus being used to destroy us from the inside. I don't know. We want less federal assembly support. So we're gonna need someone else here. Um, so I'm gonna give us like less daily democracy support. If anything, we'll probably try to get. Well, I we gotta remove at least one of these guys. I'm not gonna remove this guy. He's so good for political power. We're probably gonna remove this guy. Political power gain, democracy support. Remove this guy and replace him with whoever can get us more non-aligned support. Yeah, Jakob Huber. So after that, arm neutrality, Dominion's break of the crown, okay. Um, replace passive spirit with defensive spirit, lose political power, get more population back, again, more max entrenchment, daily command power, gain, lose civil factory construction speed, add citizens and militias and reserve Switzerland, which grants, oh my god, add units to template Switzerland and Switzerland, sets template calf, Jesus Christ, um, allied espionage, purchase American planes, Allied gold. The maelstrom and sanctions that envelop current affairs have been have made gold more gold trade more limited and difficult, but with a neutral stance, we can open the possibility for increased gold trade with other democratic nations, propping up democratic economies that keep fascism at bay. It's all plan. Ah, well, absolute neutrality. Surrounded by potential invaders, the Swiss Confederation must be careful not to break our tenuous neutrality, or we at risk losing our island democracy to, to the rising tides of war. And that's France. They don't like us, but they don't have to like us, I guess. You know. Um, airframes. We probably want to go with a small airframe there. I guess we'll too. That'd be good. Well, we're looking okay now. More, oh, definitely more defensive, which is fine. I like more war support, but whatever. Yeah. Strong cantoral power, which sucks. More industry, I guess. Go with that one for now. And then I'll grab you if we can. I like this guy more. More daily command power seems pretty good. Oh, the bank's democratic stuff. Both international. Um, so, balance power is to the left of strong cantonal power range. That's going to take 30 days, but we'll definitely get over there, so that'll be fine. Um, here, get that too, because that's nice. So, give us another day. Purchase American planes. Fighter and close air support planes from the U.S. Interesting. Our Air Force lacks the necessary numbers and technology to defend ourselves efficiently. Oh, we can't do this one either. Because um, we haven't done this one. Uh, so we must look elsewhere to procure our equipment. If we're going to buy planes from another nation, the U.S., with a tradition of democracy, relative neutrality, and outstanding aeronautic engineering, is the ideal candidate. It's 2.68 political power every day. Jesus Christ, that's so nice. And now we can do dem close to democratic ties, which sounds like a pretty historical thing to do, but connect to the Maginot, maybe that's not historical. Join the Alliance, not historical, but whatever. 
I want Gotthardbund. Election for the president? Um, the time for bickering and factionalism is over. It's time for Switzerland to unite under a single democracy, with a categorical authority to make sweeping measures, all in the name of the survival of our Swiss traditions and values. We will resist and prevail. Aggressive spirit. Nice, nice, nice. Because this one, our neutrality, yeah. That's going to description all this stuff. Defensive spirit. Nice. So, who gets removed? Well, active fascism goes down, which is fine. Active data democracy support. Hmm. Swiss neutrality is okay. Yeah, this gives more daily democracy support, anyways. So we're losing fascism, fascist support, which is fine-ish, not really, but still. Hmm. Yeah, I don't definitely don't want to lose them. Over here, Giuseppe Motta. Yeah, Maya. Lose Maya. Albert Maya. Actually, no, we want to lose this guy. Even though this gives him more daily democracy support, I still want to build up more civvies. Uh, I want to build up more civvies, so. Huh. Bauman? We can get rid of Bauman and get rid of Bauman. Bauman is gone. And so to do this one, balance power is fine. We have enough support, less than 90% support for that, which is totally okay. Um, so. Impressor of Vorlberg. But we've got to keep working on destroying our Federal Assembly. So It's easy to grow this one compared to this one. Even though we do want non-aligned. Herzog. <clears throat> Material designer cost. Plus 20% research speed. That's not bad. But it would be better if we had 4 research slots for that one. For the military national. So it costs a little bit of political power, but that's alright. So now it should be going down by 0 0.02, which is good. Slowly going down. This is slowly going up as well. Slowly going down, I guess, and slowly going down, but that's alright. Because now we should be there. We're barely in the cusp, which is hard to see here. Oh boy, compromise of the cantons. Oh! If I move to the right and you get 150 political power, consolidate council power. Strong. Wow. 40% boost for 30% stability. Jesus Christ. That's intense. But, got all of them. Yes, you know, under a uh, type of bickering and factionalism is over. It's time for Switzerland to unite under single democracy. With a categorical authority to make sweeping measures, all in the name of our survival of our Swiss traditions values, we will resist and prevail. Oh, we have more decisions here. Open banks to democratic nations. Ooh. Add Swiss gold trade if they accept. Using Switzerland to trade gold. Purchase fighters from the U.S. I want that one. France will trade the gold through us. This means they will store the gold reserves with us, allowing them to buy and sell gold freely without having to worry about embargoes. They're not the only ones that will stand to gain from this, as the influx of money will help our struggling economy. It can even be used as a bargaining chip in the future. Beautiful. The Reich did not like that. Oh. Oh, they went Latvia. Bye, Latvia. Oh, hi, Poland. And, oh, I guess two Polands. Uh, the German Reich considers us in British neutrality. Our German neutrality is not only maintained by our equal attitude towards every other country, but also by the perception of it. <clears throat> According to the German Reich, we've broken a promise of neutrality in favor of their enemies over them. They have communicated that unless they're at peace soon, they'll just stop considering us a neutral nation even to their war on us. Worrying. Oh, shnikes. Oh, it was no more than negative 35. Jesus Christ. Back to your negotiations. Hmm. Hope I can appease them. So you can increase trade. I would like that. Well, you know what? Let's save just in case. This is my first actual run through of this as well, so. Um. I would like to do the negotiations. Plus 50 would almost help us out completely. So. Plus for Vorlberg. Swiss on the offensive. Neutral Entente. Because we need to do our neutrality as well. Our long standing neutrality is an integral part of the Swiss identity. But neutrality alone cannot guarantee our sovereignty. After all, how much did it help Belgium in the Great War? The best deterrent is the whole nation ready to take up arms and fight against any invader. Fortify a border with France. 
which help us with Germany as well. Despite the commitment to their democratic values and long-standing friendly relations, we cannot ignore the possibility that France could trespass on Swiss territory to launch a sneak attack in Germany or Italy. So, oh, 37 days, that's not good. Oh, how many days is this going to take? Well, you know what, I'll save again, just in case. If it doesn't go well, then it doesn't go well. Did it go well? No? Well, Crap. David Frankfurter's trial approaches. The trial of David Frankfurter, who back in February assassinated a Nazi party representative in Davos, is near. With problems for him to have a fair and neutral trial, but there are certainly other options. We can secretly free him, recruit him for intelligence operations, or instead have to try to appease the German Reich by canceling the trial and sentencing him right away instead. Whatever we do, planning every single... Pleasing every side might be beyond means. Clearly guilty? Now, we're at 20, negative 25, which is fine. Uh, which would be fine. The trial continues, continues plan, of course. What if I have the border still? Um, the towns would like that too a little bit, so that's good too. Um, we're out of guns, really out of guns. We need some trains, we need more support equipment, so we're really out of a lot of stuff. The trial of him again. The whole of Switzerland. And his neighbors have eyes on the trials of David Frankfurter. The result of this trial not only revealed the fate of the self declared guilty party, but the Swiss Confederation as a whole, and what lengths it was willing to compromise in its institutions and traditions. All sense from the court are pointing towards a fair prison sentence, but influence from the council could change the outcome of the trial and perhaps even the very essence of the country. Let the courts make the decision. Live prison sentence. Um, he's done serves as democracy, he should be pardoned. Pardoned a killer. No, that's alright. Let him balance it out. 50, that's not bad. Concessions of Swiss Fascist Party. France, they don't like that. But that will help out with, uh, Italy at least a little bit more, which I don't want them to be pissed, too pissed off. But I like this one a lot. It serves as prison. As council decided to stay away from the case and to leave it to courts in Grism's Law, uh, David Frankfurter, who willingly, willfully assassinated Wilhelm Gustloff, was sentenced to 18 years of prison. We know the German Reich would have wanted a much more punitive sentence, so our diplomats will have to work cut out for them in order to appease them, but we couldn't risk seeming to take sides in times like these. Our new choice is what might keep the Swiss people safe during the storm that might come. It's the best we can do right now. France will let us share it through, go through them. This is beautiful. See if she's created. Nice. <clears throat> More, 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 please. But that should help us out with 60, right? We should get a 60 with the focus done. Oh! Whoa! Whoa, 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 whoa. I was not expecting that. How do we do this? So, it still needs to be to the left. Um, We should probably push for strength and high command still. So we need to save our PP. And we'll continue doing this stuff as well. Our neutrality. So, aggressive with spirits with defensive spirit. Okay. Uh huh. I'm neutral. That kind of hurts us. I like the aggressive one. The aggressive one's better. No, maybe not. You still lose political power, though. No, you don't. Command power. Actually, that's not as bad. Because right now we get war support. You lose, basically, you don't get any war support. So let's do that one real quick. You do get some more max retrenchment, too, which is pretty nice. So, what is this? I'm not seeing this. Benito, what are you doing? Oh, the communists are here. Nice. Hopefully I don't get copyright struck from this song, too. Because if it does, you won't see this part because I have to clip it out. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. I still want more trade, though. What do they get here? So, does that add even more? But we got to wait and sa save it anyway, so still... Nice. Our neutrality. I want to be defensive and stuff, but still. Alright, Frontier Defense Plan. I like this one more. Give our construction speed, and that guy's pretty good. Because you get more organization, army regain, and stuff like that. That's so strong. But we're going to be aggressive and try to unite and demand the French Alps, Alpine Redoubt. Demand Italian Alps. So we're going to really be def very defensive. Or really, actually, really aggressive. Which makes more sense for us to go this way. Um, defend the skies. Expand military support. Long service. Integrate refugees in the army. The army position. Um, see the Swiss Plateau and retreat to the Alps. Frontier defense, exp expedite mobilization. Or we say screw it, all those training, which I kind of prefer, but you need to be full cantonal power for that. Um, 
Canton's is active side. Attack from the mountains. You lose a lot of land for construction speed. Get more attack though. Emergency industry. Defend the skies. For the Jura. Rig infrastructure to blow. Um, ban the Swiss Communist Party. Petition after that one. But we're not going to go that way either, so. Uh, I do like this guy more. Because you do get more. You get defense. And we're going to need a lot of defense. Just flat defense. You get military factories. How many factories do you get on this one? Even though I do prefer getting more organization. Organization is more important, in my opinion, for something. You get more organization here, too. You get a lot of defense. Just a lot of land forts. Um... I think we go from Henri Gisan. Our political system allows for a single general and commander in chief only in times of extreme need, when our confederation is at risk. Certainly one of those situations the man for the job is obvious. Henri Gisan is not only the most qualified for the job, but he also enjoys widespread popularity across the Swiss Confederation. Oh, Swiss militias. Military rate is 60 out of 100. People of Switzerland are in the eyes of the storm of fascism, so they must be ready to defend the democratic way of living. All of our military readiness will be spent, removed, remove citizens' militia and reserve, add and deploy, which hurts us. Council President's speech, increase the by 20. Military drive, plus 30. Distribute weapons. Broaden militias. The cap to higher. Um, it's not bad, too. Improve divisions. Oh, what does this mean? Add units to template? Ooh, that'd be good to do as well. Uh, but in the meantime, we still have to come over here and do something like this. Push for centralization? No. There we go. We'll do that. Carlos Uprising, very nice, very nice. Oh, it, oh, Italy did, oh, did they melt? Okay, so Italy ended up in some war, and uh, Yugoslavia is killing itself too, or like puppeting itself. Um, we're actually pretty good with the Germans overall. Probably denounced them. Uh, Pakistan and India, Swiss fascist party. Show of defensive force. Too costly, opinion plus 30. Well, we're gonna need more political power, so. So we'll see about that. And we should be able to do this one very soon, too. Balance powers to the left. Uh, as the Austrian government remains in shambles, we must fulfill the democratic will of Borlberg. Express them in a 1990 referendum and integrate them into a democracy. It's a duty of the Swiss Confederation to protect them against the fascism and autocracy. The Austrian government has accepted a request for Borlberg's freedom. Austria's seen the line and agree with us that Borlberg's place is with the Swiss Confederation as his newest canton. This is merely the first step in Switzerland's path for more democratic Europe. More democracy. Ah, a thicker nation. I love it. Which is victory points. Um, can you do every tile? That'd be kind of cool. Guard forts. Rails. Just guard everything, you know. Also, at this point, um, we're doing the Federal Police Intelligence Department because we have to wait to get down to here, preempt Anschluss. So, we gotta wait just a little bit. But this will give us more, more fascism, which will help lower democracy support. So, if we fall to defend Switzerland from external enemies, only do they let us come to internal ones. We must empower the Federal Police to root out possible threats inside our borders and defend against foreign elements in our soil, of course. Which would be a very, very good thing to do. Oh, and... Oh, the Soviets have a civil war, too. Good God, that's going to make Germany really freaking strong. Um, 20 over or 25? I prefer 25 over. Yeah, that'd be good. Um, after that, then what? We need to create an intelligence agency, officer support, internet network strength gain, offer, operative support, so pro Helvetica. Uh, minimum decreases the minimum military readiness needed to activate the citizens' militia. More political power. Fifty percent is not bad. That's actually pretty good too. Holy shnikes, that's pretty decent too. Yeah, I like that a lot. Bombs. I love bombs. Bombing people. But do we really need that right now? We need trucks probably more than just bombs. As much as I love bombs. Show defensive force. More opinion. Looking all right. Concessions to the Swiss fascist party. No, we're okay. But probably. Yeah, this would be good to do so we can get over there so we can get that extra um, secret pack. That's not bad, too. I want to do that, too. I want to do a lot of things. Whatever. Um, this would be super good to get. Even more political power. Oh, but we can stuff up here. Protect Liechtenstein. That was more manpower. Ne neutral Entente. Planes Warfare. Mechanized Model. More Army XP in a factory. More factories. Armor, armor. Army XP, extending supply lines, that's not bad too. Or a Swiss Navy? Swiss ship designs. 
Buy foreign surplus ships. Building fortresses, sub raiders. Naval industry. Build naval bases on every existing naval base. Max 15. Whoa. Train navy staff. I kind of want to protect them there, but still. I kind of really want that one. I think this would be good. Um, two military factors would be really nice as well. Uh, but I want this more. Okay, so we're getting political power. Weroham. We cannot let our neighbors know that we're trying to gather intelligence on them, so we must rely on semi independent intelligence agencies to take on our covert operations. That's where the photography businessman turned spy master Hans Hauselman comes in with a small, nimble intelligence office. He can do the work that needs to be done without getting our hands dirty. Yeah, great. As we're going to keep beelining towards this as well, so. Strength of military high command, I love it. And, ooh, grand battle plan for even more max entrenchment would be nice. We're not releasing, releasing artillery, though. Grand battle plan is not bad, though. The just amount of soft attack you can get is insane can, from that stuff. Small airframes, interwar, nope. Nope, we're probably not going to have any carriers with this group either. So let's save our army XP for now. We don't have to spend it, so we're not going to spend it yet. Push for centralization. Um, ooh. So we remove this guy. Uh, no. Uh, uh, Albert Meyer. Yeah, get rid of him. Yeah, more factories, nice. Get another thing for guns and put it there and put it there. It's a day. There you go. He's gone. Oh, we don't have. It. Oh, let's go and get some penalties for us. Hans Osler. Albrecht. It's alright, whatever. We we'll take some penalties for now. Um, protect Liechtenstein. That'd be nice. Or Pro Helvetia. Helvetia. Spiritual defense of Switzerland requires that Swiss culture remain singular, indivisible, and distinct from her neighbors. This new organization, Pro Helvetia, will preserve and promote our shared Swiss values deeply tied to our democracy and ensure our survival against, uh, survival against overwhelming. Overwhelming odds, probably. I don't know. So now we need less than 70% support for them. So we don't have to do that, which is fine. We just need less support. Oh. Okay, let's get rid of that guy. That's really bad. He's gonna grow fast support if we really wanted to. Um, daily communist support. So much democracy. We need less democracy here. Way more political power, that'd be nice. Power gain, militaristic democrat, fascist propagandist, weapons designer. That guy hurts. Ernst? Oh boy. Weapons designer. Support for unaligned. That's not bad too. We want to grow our un non aligned area too. But we have to balance this all out. Plus 0 0.07. That's not bad. If I had to get rid of anybody, it'd probably be this guy. Oh, he's so good though. I don't want to get rid of him. Um, let's be kind of crazy, because we need less than how much support? 70%, I think? Less than 70% support. So we really need someone to knock this down just a little bit more. And getting rid of this guy and getting something else will really help us out. So, yeah. As much as I don't, I need to get rid of this guy, that 50% is just so freaking strong. I cannot give it up just yet. So we'll probably go with fascist support. So is any good fascist? Or even communist. Upgrade time. More political power. Plus 0.3. Uh, probably go this guy. Corporatist. It's fine. There you go. There's a lot of political power, but we're back up to 2.66, which is nice. Well, you got good lips. And there's Italian Union. Goodbye. Protect Lincoln. Same day focus. That's a bit too much, in my opinion, but who am I? Bit too much. Negative 70 is not good. Distribute weapons. How many guns do we have in reserve? Not a ton. We can max it out. Deploy them. Some more production. Yeah. Improve divisions. You know what? Let's do this. Do that. And then improve divisions. Add units to template. So we can probably make just more. Which I don't think is entirely what we want to do, but it's what we've got for now. So. Nice. 
15% more political power and better consumer goods as well. Nice, 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 nice. Awesome. We're pretty good so far. And then we should be able to do this. But right now, this should be racing to the bottom. I, I love. Love, 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 love. Full council control. I would like to protect the elected incentives as well. Increase maximum readiness by more. Um, activate citizens must be down by 30. Adopt the Rumch language. Ban national movement for Switzerland. S uh, Spirit of St. Bernard. No. Field hospital for militia has been removed. Oh! Field hospital trickle back plus 50%. That's pretty important. Redo it, nothing now. Henri Gisson is proposing a different way of defending Switzerland. It's trying to defend the borders of the country regardless of the price. We can strategically cede the Swiss plateau and retreat to the Alps where we can make it cost for enemies to occupy us. But preempt Anschluss. The rumblings of the German Reich are looking to annex Austria in the name of German unity. This is not something the Swiss Confederation can allow as it will empower the German Reich to make the same claims about a German-speaking cantons. So we must arrange to set the stage for defense of all of Austria. Hopefully we can get to them before the Germans do. So let's save just in case. And if I have to do some funky stuff, so be it. I'm all about that funky stuff. 115 out of 115 is better speech. Improve divisions, focus some more production. Ooh, 64. Way better consumer goods and construction speed. But right now, um, 15 over 15 would be used for trade. So if doing that, would be we would do nothing, right? 25, yeah. Roughly, we're there. 15, 10, yeah. We're already roughly there, already maxed out what we have. So doing that would be kind of a waste. Broader militia set the cap to 25 because our cap is now at 20, and we want to make more anyways. Improve divisions. As much as I want to do this one, it doesn't make any sense. More, make them better. Add units to template. So you, what do you mean units? You mean battalions? Oh, so instead of those are three or two or three, I think it's three. You had another one. That makes us a little bit stronger as well, which I do like. Military readiness would be better. Um, can we improve this fascist party? Um, France doesn't like that, and they don't like us that much. Increase seek trade. Uh, purchase five from America. They don't like that. I already get to do this one too. Yeah, this one's pretty good to do. End of the Soviet Civil War. All right. Well, whatever. Prim the Anschluss. So we need even less for that stuff too. I I do want to do this route again sometime, but we'll see. Bunch of German planes. Without an air force, oh. and the lacking industry and technology to produce aircraft in any significant amounts, we are forced to rely on purchasing them from our neighbors. Buying the planes we need from German Reich not only provides us with equipment we need, but also helps us keep ourselves on the good side. Towns across the Alps celebrate the union of our two Alpine nations. We will be able to better defend ourselves against the great powers that surround us completely. Free cores! Now that's a nice Switzerland. Oh, we got the divisions as well. Oh, do we ac get actual divisions? Oh, get rid of them, god dang it. Oh, that's so much better. Look at that peepee -pee we got, though. It's very nice. We do have nice peepee. -pee. Oh, let's grab you. Finally, thank God. Oh. Oh, my goodness. I want to throw more RD on there. I really do. We need some field hospitals and stuff like that, but still. Basic airframes, small airframes, you know what? We have the arm XP for this. Oh, we have nothing in here. God freaking dang it. Engine 1. That's all we got. Bomb sites. We have Schnackies. Well, for a hundred here. Oh, we can spend the guns. That's fine. No issue with that. Let's spend it here, too. Negative hundred's not good. Why is it negative a hundred? Oh. That did nothing for us, though. 
publicly appease them? Denounce them. That's okay to do as well. There's zero. Now it's negative 60, which is fine. Let's see, trade. Does that do anything too, maybe? Does that help us out at all? Anymore? It does. Nice. I would like to show more defensive force, but you know, whatever. Yeah, that is nothing. So, is that bugged? That might be bugged. I don't know. I could be wrong, but that doesn't seem like it does very much of anything. Um, we have plenty of guns now, so I'm not super concerned about it. Negative 60. Purchase bombers. They won't like that. Positive relations with other people. Negative effect. Publicly denounce France. Well, we do that in two. It's fine for now. Whatever, they'll get over it. Uh, purchase German planes, because I really want to keep working knocking this down as much as we can. So we'll probably get rid of this guy, even though we get so much PP from it. It's not funny. Oh, we can't choose that guy, so we have to choose. Why, what's the point of even choosing this guy? Mobile, why would you choose Mobile Warfare? I don't understand. Um, speech, war production, more cap for militias, or did that do nothing? Oh, we had to wait for this one too. So they all hate us now. Oh, great. Alright, so now we're at what, 20? And now we're at 6, that's not bad. I would personally like to improve these guys again. Cap growth base. Consumer good wise. We're looking not bad too. I'm not sure how many forts we're honestly probably gonna need to make quite a few forts here, truth be told. Because I don't trust that we're gonna be able to hold the line here at all. So But we'll see, you never know. But you just never know. 45 would be a waste. 45, go down by 40. Yeah, doing this would not be bad. Go and do this since we're gonna expand it anyways. Plus 60 is super nice. Improved divisions. Add unit templates. That's just better to do. Alright, so. We're pretty grand battle plan-y. I think we want more soft attack. Go ahead and do that one. It's fine, whatever. Expansion directory. Nice. Ah, German plans. So they should like us a little bit more now. All right, so anything else we can do yet? No, we'd be less than 60%. We're currently 61. Oh my god, 62 basically. Let's do a 35 day focus because that'll be very nice for us to get the stuff. Those cantons. Adds adopted. The, oh. Action Nationale Widerstand. Oh, that's not bad, too. Daily democracy support. That's what we definitely don't want, though. Train Swiss women. I love women, especially Swiss women. Oh, man. This would be good. We, we gotta research that next. Let's do this one. Everyone's gonna be suspicious of us. And that's okay. Modernize the Air Force. Case West. Well, if we wanna go fascist, that's definitely possible, but. Protect Liechtenstein. Which between three of our cantons, the principality of Liechtenstein must be protected in order to safeguard the people. After all, we couldn't stand a chance against any foreign army, including ours. We can offer our assistance by occupying the territory. They can join our oath and become our newest canton. Some war production. Let's see where we're at after one of these six days. Yeah, we're going to need to spend some. I don't want to spend that there. I don't want to spend this here either. Purchase fighters from these guys. Oh. We're going to need more guns, aren't we? Yeah. Let's grab two more things of steel. That's going to help us out with guns a lot. Alright, so. 
do that. And brought in militias. We got the PP for it now, especially since we're stockpiling it quite a bit. The French don't like it. It's publicly denounced France. The Reich. It's okay for now, too. Really fast support's fine. 57%. Very nice. Very, very nice. Oh, uh, this is 50%. Oh, we're too fascist now. Don't you hate when we're too fascist? 20% is quite a bit. Man, god dang it. And trying to balance is, is just very difficult. Expedite mobilization. The role of our small and extending army is to hold the enemy, while the people of Switzerland take up arms and form the citizens' militias, the bulk of our defense forces. The government must make sure that they can be as ready as soon as possible to reduce the risk of our standing army being overrun. Not bad. A fortified border with Italy would not be bad either. Italian expansion's ambitions could spill over Switzerland at any moment. After all, a significant part of the population is Italian speaking, and it would all take us a speech from Benito Mussolini in Switzerland it will be in their sights. We must show them that we're not an easy target. Ban the Communist Party. I do want to get rid of ooh. less stability, more fascism, more fascism, more fascism. Let's drop from the League of Nations. Limited censorship of the press. Trading with Germany. Axis goal. That's not bad too. Okay. Ban the Swiss Communist Party. The Swiss Communist Party is supposed to be a danger, a great danger to the Swiss Confederation. Despite the distance between us and the Union of Soviet uh, Republics of Europe and Asia, the revolutionary influence can be felt in the air. We cannot risk destabilizing our country in such a dangerous time, so we must act swiftly and ban any party that seeks to upend and undermine the government. Spirit of St. Bernard. Since time of memorial, we have pardoned ourselves for our medical tradition of willingness to help people in need. The great St. Bernard Hospice and the Red Cross organization are testament to that. Now, the spirit can be weaponized and reoriented to the militias in order to bolster defense forces. But if you enjoyed the video, leave a like. Subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below. And I'll see you tomorrow as we try to expand more Switzerland. Thanks for watching. Have a great Swiss rest of your day.